Hello everyone. So I decide to do a quick video on how to um, <coughs> change the settings so that you will have the maximum quality for music streaming through Zoom. Uh, there are some hidden uh, settings that it will hinder your uh, music audio quality if, if we don't know about. Okay, so this the first one is we will go to the Zoom web page, so zoom.us will sign in your account by your by using your email and then we we'll click on our account we go go to settings so zoom basically it's designed primarily for speech so speaking and speech is mostly mono um, so it's very different from uh, how to say music and all the sounds uh, that uh, it's coming from two sources because when we listen to music usually it comes from two sources meaning the two speakers so we go to the settings here <coughs> we'll, we will want to make our zoom sounds stereo meaning that when we play back the, the whatever YouTube or whatever in, in our computer it will transmit the true stereo sound if not it will be mono sound which is a disaster for music so we will go down to the uh, allow participant to I will just quickly type in the stereo here so you scroll down and you find the option of allowing user to select stereo audio in their client setting by default this is off so we will want to turn it on and then in the audio option in the advanced you will have it will appear this option use stereo audio if you don't go into your account to adjust these hidden settings there will be no option to use stereo uh, audio it will be uh, purely mono so that is one hidden option we need to adjust I say again you go to your account settings so you scroll down until you find allow users to select stereo audio in their client settings so that's the one of the hidden setting the first thing and then you go into your audio options you will want to choose uh, the speakers and the microphone wh whichever is your computers uh, I'm using an external sound card so that's why I'm choosing this Okay, um, we want to choose suppress background noise low. Here Zoom also says that uh, when it comes to music, optimized for music, we should choose the noise suppression low. What it does is that if you play music and you put it too high, it will, uh, it will chop up your music. So it detects less like, like the music like noise. So we want to put it low. Okay, and after you play music, if it's just purely talking then you can put it back to high okay and then we go into the advanced we will want to check the enable original sound from microphone what it does is that uh, if we don't choose this one uh, it will play back the audio in our computer usually uh, if you don't have an external sound card your microphone will pick up the music from your speaker so if we don't use this enable original sounds it will continue to chop up your audio and if we click on this one especially if you have an external sound card meaning that it will play directly from your computer uh, it will maintain the original audio quality and sounds so it will not interfere and then when you have a meeting let me go to my meeting I just I was just started a meeting by myself we will see that there will be an option of turn off or turn on original sound. We, we will make sure to click it, make it blue, and then it says turn off original sound, meaning that we are using the external sounds, meaning that whatever we are playing back through uh, the sounds of our computer and Zoom is sending out, it's being sent out as the highest and the original quality. So those are... Uh, the settings that uh, I think in my experience we need to adjust and we need to pay, pay attention to so we can maximize the audio quality for music streaming if it is uh, speech then it should be okay uh, leaving it at default but 
for music we need to we need to change it okay so that's all i hope this video will help you guys and uh thank you for watching goodbye